Hi, my name is Remy and I'm an audiologist at Ng Teng Fong General Hospital. No, my job has nothing to do with mixing audio. What I do is to test and manage hearing problems in patients of all ages. And what not everybody knows is that your sense of balance is actually tied to your ears. We work alongside ear, nose and throat doctors to assist in providing a diagnosis. For folks with hearing loss, I prescribe and further optimize a suitable hearing device for them. Developments in hearing technology have come very far, especially in helping the elderly stay connected. With newer devices being rechargeable and Bluetooth enabled, they can be used to take phone calls, watch TV and listen to music, which are all Ama's favourite hobbies. I personally have a background in engineering, so I find the technology really interesting. But more than that, my job is about the human aspect of listening to and connecting with my patients. Hello? Hello? My hearing aid is spoiled. I need to get it fixed. Can I get your name, sir? Yes. Huber. Sure, Mr. Huber, your appointment is in an hour's time. I you have are... appointment. I make appointment already. Patients can so often be seen as unruly or rude. But in reality, they just have difficulty hearing and communicating. That's when I'm usually called upon to help. As audiologists, we use simple but effective strategies to better communicate with our patients. A problem with the hearing aid, but your appointment is at 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock, okay? They are, you are early. There are other patients in front of you. Okay, you have to wait. Okay? Wait now. Yeah, you have to wait. I can hear so clearly now. Yeah, so good. Yeah, good, good. Thank you, Mr. Remy. Okay, no problem, Mr. Hoover. When my patients' hearing aids are fixed, my colleagues are always surprised to see how polite and grateful they are. My role also involves helping patients who are unable to come in for an appointment. With teleaudiology, we can fine-tune their hearing aids or troubleshoot their devices remotely. Losing one of your senses even for a few hours can be disorienting and scary. The faster we solve these issues, the earlier we can put our patients at ease. Seeing people regain their independence and confidence is why I chose this profession. I get to make a tangible difference. I am Remy New and I found my purpose in being an audiologist.